What's going on YouTube? How y'all feeling today? Well in today's video, I have a Lightroom preset tutorial for you guys today. Really quick, simple, can enhance those gray photos that you have. You know, if you spend time, you know, trying to figure out how you can enhance a certain photo that you have that's gray or just bland and not a lot of colors, not a lot of popping colors. Well, I have just a preset for you. Okay, so so some things I will be going through going through throughout the video are color grading, uh, lighting using the s curve so if you guys like that type of stuff don't forget to like comment you know what i'm saying and uh i'll see you guys in lightroom let's go i'm gonna reset everything i'm gonna reset this set light and we're gonna don't worry we're gonna we're gonna get it all back we're gonna get it all back and we're gonna reset down here as well the effects okay so this is the blaze this is the base photo and i'm gonna show you guys how i got my preset to work I don't like how much light this this photo has so I bought the exposure down just a little bit it said it was about 0.57 but we could do any anywhere you can adjust it anyhow you feel comfortable uh, we bought the contrast down because um, overall ambience a lot darker but if you want to make it darken you can add contrast but this pitch is pretty dark anyway so I just lightened it up by moving the contrast back the highlights it's not too much highlights but it is kind of bright on this section so we brought that down a little bit down a little bit just a little bit um i bought the shadows up just to add more details and i bought the whites down just a little bit also added in more blacks to add more details and then from here we use the curve tool to release you can really see everything come together with the curve tool so i just bought it down a little bit on the Instagram because it's, it's a well balanced photo anyway from the Instagram it's it is kind of bright so it's leaning towards the light lighter side but you know we straighten everything up oh whoa 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 I mean that's kind of the look anyway but you know we brought it up and everything stayed the same down here we play with it a little bit and we see how, how oh, you see how detailed it is now. So then after that, I don't think we play with saturation, but we could if we wanted to, or vibrance, vibrancy. Like we could take away the green, the green color, a little bit. But I kind of leave that for the color grading. So that's that. Uh, color grading we have we adjusted red we adjusted brown and we adjusted I mean orange and we adjusted green we didn't adjust any other colors because I don't see any other colors in the photo so I wouldn't adjust anything but whoa turn them 10 right there 10 man but yeah that's that's for that so after that I came to my color grading and then I played with it but I see the colors in the in the picture are more green and brown so i use i use a lot of a lot of brown i use a lot of brown to color grade this picture but it's like it's so slight you can barely see it so i also should do a mask to make it a little darker up top so i add in a gradient but then my where it really comes in handy is the effects so this is what i'm talking about where it adds detail so you just i bump my clarity up to 13. and then i dehaze down to seven had added 15 vignette yeah, yeah. I mean, anything over 30 you're killing the game bro so you're, you you want to do under 30 maybe you feel like it might need more in your picture so add as add as you please i normally stay under 30 i try to stay under 30 i don't want i don't want my picture to be vignetted out of this world so i think i left everything else the same pretty much i may have added some green uh, to give it a film a look if you want to add some green but and i left everything the same Good job and I, now i can add my mask if i want to add a mask i could just add a mask and then i could just pull this down and take off some exposure to that like add some depth to it you know add some depth take off some of the shadows and some highlights and just play with it like just you know what i'm saying just have fun i'm gonna bring up this exposure a little bit saying so have some, have some fun and then boom. I mean, I barely did anything, but it looks a little bit natural. 
But yeah, I, I just want to establish that natural look. I don't want to have too much darkness up there and it's like, okay, it looks fake. Videos, you know, check out other videos. Don't, don't just, yeah, don't forget to check out my other video. I'm dropping a vlog. So don't forget to check that out, guys. Uh, see you guys later. Just check out my Instagram. I post my projects, my photos on there, and also respond to DMs. So if y'all are interested in whatever content I post, if y'all want to get a photo shoot or something like that, hit me up on there. All right, peace.